Alrighty guys, welcome back to another video. So uh, as hopefully you guys all did know as well, the Demonic Beast has uh, reset. So I have never gotten further than the second floor. Well, I just finished the second floor of, Scar of Skull and Hardy earlier today. And I've got no relics for these guys at all. As you can see, 0 out 11. Obviously the Thonar relic is the one that I want. Uh, after that, I'll be getting King's relic. Um, but I, as you can see, I do have enough Twilight Sources, uh, and I'm super close on the uh, little gemstone-y things. Um, so I'm honest, I think I'm just going to do this real quick to hopefully get uh, enough of what I need. Uh, and this is the team that I've been running. Uh, I kind of started talking about it in uh, one of my last videos, um, but I wanted to save it for this video and show you guys my current run. Um, this has been my most effective team. It is a bit more RNG based than the King team. King team, you can kind of just patience your way through the whole thing and not really be too concerned about your cards. Um, but like, and I know my CC is not super, super high. I haven't fully invested and like I've got all cosmetics on Freya, maxed, the other ones I've got. I don't have anything really for, for this Liz. Um, I've got a Holy Relic. I've got everything for Trader Melly, and then I'm slowly, slowly going to work my way through uh, stuff for Thonar as well, because she's just really not tanky. Uh, at least that's my experience. So um, this is the team that I did, and I got me to Floor 3 final, final phase. So... Um, again, it, it took me a while to get there. Lots of resets and lots of starting again. So we'll see how we go with this run. But I'm hoping we can at least finish floor two and then get myself the Thonar Relic. So we will we'll do this video and then we'll hopefully get the Relic and then we'll do another video where I'll showcase the Relic and hopefully it'll actually be decent. Because I wanted to show you guys my full kind of... Um, I suppose experience or run with Skull and Hardy because I, I do I do obviously find it still difficult. I can't clear it comfortably like I can you know the the, the first two demonic beasts like deer and bird. Um, so and I feel like we watch a lot of like you know whales and stuff that just kind of bully their way through and just can just easily do it. Um, and I'm hoping I'm more kind of along the lines of the rest of you guys, which is still a little bit of a struggle. Um, so, I've got attack, crit defense, I think it is on Thona. I've got attack, crit on my uh, Freya. I've got attack, crit on Melly, and I've got HP defense on um, Liz. I should probably have crit defense on these two as well, because I do get pretty, uh, pretty weak, should I say. Um, but... We're going to just basically be... Hmm. I think I'm just going to... And I'm going to save my heal card here. I'm just going to use... No, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to do that. That. No, I lied to you all again. I'm going to do that to get a ult. And then I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to do that. And that'll get me melee ult and... Uh, Freya ult as well. So I've got a 3-6 melee and I've got a 3-6 Freya. I think I've got a, I want to say a 4-6 green Liz. Oh, perfect. Uh, and I've got a 3-6 Thonar. So by no means max relics, um, but but not bad. Uh, so are you going to, you're probably going to infect me here, aren't you? Yes. Okay, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that and that okay uh so i don't really need a heal here but i'm gonna grab some ultimate gauge while i can um and then just try and get as much melee passive going as i can and then i'm gonna have a stance cancel for next turn and a debuff removal which is nice so it fix but i'll be able to cleanse this as well so this is honestly, I've tried a few different teams now, and this is, apart from the, the King patient, Patience team, this has kind of been the most effective, just because I find that, oh, I don't know, it's just like, it's very difficult for, do I use Freya ult here? I don't really want to get infected again if I can help it. Let's do it. Um, I'm probably going to get infected again, but that's okay. Um, 
yeah, I just I've tried a whole bunch of different teams. I've tried like the one ultimate instead of Trader Melee. I've tried it instead of Freya. I've tried Scardi and Brunhild. I know, like, I don't know, do it. Oh, that's perfect. That's a very, very nice uh, little line up there. That was very clean. Um, okay, so now this is the one where I've got to kill them together. Oh, the damage cap's gone. Oh. Okay, I've, okay, I've got to remember the damage cap's gone. So I think I'm going to do... How much HP do you have? 800k. And 788k. There's no way we, like, one tap here. So I'm going to do that. 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 And I think we can maybe one tap with this. Let me see. Might have to do the whole stop and start again. But <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll see. Okay, and then am I going to kill here? Oh, I'm so close. All right, uh, we're going to do that, and then we'll be one second. Uh, I think I'm going to have to slightly switch that around. Because um, you want to kill them at the same time. That increase in... That removal of damage cap is awesome. But it also makes it a lot a lot easier to kill the wrong person at the wrong time so I think I think instead what I'm going to do is I will swap those attacks around because Melly is hitting hard there so I think I'm going to do one two oh is that the wrong way around yeah that's the wrong way around so I'm going to do one and two three Four, because it's got slightly more health. Uh, Hardy does. So I'm hoping that this just, yeah, good. And then if I can, perfect. That is that's beautiful. That's very nice to get rid of that. A hundred one million health restored. Um, I've got one of those plus two of those. That's three. Oh, I'm one short. Bugger. Okay. Um, I think. I got one of those. Yep, and then I think I'm... Yeah, one shot. Okay. Alright, this is where it's going to get slightly harder. Um, I think I'm going to basically just try and... I can't remember my strategy here. I think it's just get Lizalt as fast as possible, I want to say. Because I want to be able to heal up. So, I'm luckily I'm going into this with full HP. So, I'm going to do... Um, hmm. I'm just going to do the same same thing again, except he's a lot tankier this time. My units aren't slightly invested in enough to be able to do the damage unless I use Freya and basically just melee. The other two just will patience, and I need to get the unique proct. There we go, from Thonar. So, that is not the cards that I wanted. I do really need a stance card for next turn. So we're going to do... I'm going to do... One. Oh, no, I'm going to remove buffs first. And do that. I'm going to do... Hmm. Hmm. That. I'm going to do... That. And that. I want to keep my guys as healed up as possible. Yeah, it's doing nothing, but that's going to give me that, and then I'll... Okay, I need the crits happening from Melly. If I don't get another stance card, I'm... Oh, thank God. I was going to say, I'm screwed here otherwise. Not screwed, but not in a good place. Not where I want to be. So let's go. Ow. Bullying my Freya. Uh, so I'm going to do... One... Two. I need to heal, otherwise Freya's screwed. Um, okay. Done, and then we remove the buffs. That was probably a waste of that buff removal. I've got another one, that's okay. Alright, as you can tell I'm rambling guys, because I'm not quite as confident in the dogs as I am with the other two. Uh, just because I 
can't do them. All right. Um, I'm pretty. Calm. I'm pretty happy that I got to final phase. Final. Oh, jeez, Louise. Uh, final phase floor three with them without any holy relics because that's pretty decent. So I think here I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. That. And then that. And then I'll have alts from both of them. When I say both of them, sorry, I mean <laughs> Freya and Shredder Melly. And then I'll probably just use Freya Alt here. Perfect. I'm on full HP again for everyone. And his ult will. Freya's ult will get me through this. Hopefully this part. And I've also, yeah, I've also got a melee card as well. So I should be sweet here. And I can get rid of that buff. Oh, I'm going to have to use melee card. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to do that. That. Oh, I should probably save that card, actually. That. There we go. That. And that. And that should be... That should be enough. I almost don't want this to kill, because... Okay. A waste of a bit of a waste of a melee card, but I wanted to get that passive proc again from him. Alright, so we're not doing too badly. We're trucking along not, not quite nicely. So I'm going to do that, followed by that, that, yeah, cool. I know I kind of want my ult for the final fight here because I want to get rid of Hardy as quickly as possible. Um, I am concerned he's going to freeze my melee, actually. Don't freeze my melee. Okay. In fact, yep. So, ideally, I'm going to do that, and then we do that. Yeah. Okay. It's taking a lot of thought concentration here, team. Sorry, I'm not doing my usual commentary, but I'm having to think quite a lot about how I go about playing this because, like I said, oh, so close. I am not scared. Scared's not the right word, but have a healthy respect for this boss because I am... Uh, Doing this with no relics, apart from obviously I've got I've got lizards to be fair, but so I'm gonna do that. And if I do surely that does enough, right? And then do I heal as well? Okay, no, no, this is what we do. We do one move, and then I do that, and then I do That. That. So then I go in with Freya roll, and then I have Burn Up. Oh, we're going to do enough damage here. I really need to. I don't really want to put myself at. <laughs> do I risk this? Yeah, I think I just. Oh, this, is, this could have been a mistake here, team. Oh, I'm going to have to start again, aren't I? Uh, oh, my gosh. Don't do any damage, don't do any damage. Okay. So. I'm gonna have to use an ult here, I think. I don't really want to use Freya's. What if I just do... This is gonna be... No, this is a waste. I'm just gonna use an ult. Because then... Um... Okay. Okay, I think this is what I want to do. It's a waste of an ult, but I need to drop him. So then this next turn, what I'm going to do is I'm going to ult with Freya. And I'm going to ult with... So I'm going to ult with Freya. I'm going to ult with... 
and then I'm going to mm, melee card. That's a waste of a merge, but I need to I need to use the card. Heal me up, beautiful. And this will give me actually melee ult, which is perfect because. I don't want to get yeah, that's okay. I don't mind him getting frozen. Okay, that didn't hurt that much. That's good. Because what I really want here is um, Melee to stay alive. I'll keep his ult. So I think we can do that. 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 I'm, I'm hoping this just kills... Oh, oh, this should actually. Perfect. So no more being frozen. Back up to full HP. And doing a decent chunk of damage there. Okay, alright. We're, we're on a roll. We're on a roll here, team. I think this is the team I'm going to be using a little bit, to be honest. It just seems to be kind of working, uh, which is very nice. I'm going to do that. You know what? I kind of want alt again for... Let's do this. And if we kill, we kill, which is awesome. If not, we will go in with... This might actually kill. I hope I want to do that. Oh, I should get a revive. That's okay. And then I'm not going to be able to heal this damage back. going to get rid of alt gauge. Alright, so we're going to do this. I'm going to do that. And that. It's a shame we didn't get any melee cards because oh, I should have merged those melee cards. I used at least one of them. That's okay. Um, I wanted to get rid of his alt gauge. And now I should have Fonar's alt. So ideally I get a green heal card here. Nope, that's okay. As long as you don't hurt him too hard. This is where the passive for melee really is coming in clutch, right? Because I can just do this now. And that's that should be game. So cool. Alright. Floor three. Now I'm gonna give it a go for you guys, but I can almost guarantee I am uh, <laughs> not gonna not gonna survive this. Um, I've tried it multiple times already. Um but the main thing is I've got my I've got enough for my holy relic for her. There it is. Beautiful, beautiful. So um let's give it a final go. So again, this is I'll show you my equipment. Attack crit on Freya, HP defense on Green Liz, HP crit on Melee. This is perfect 15% gear. And this is uh attack um crit resistance, crit defense, one of the two. Um, and then I've got Tamiya Link on her, obviously, to keep her alive. Uh, Sariel for UR gear, crit damage, uh, and then just two high dew bolts. And then I've got my Demonic Beasts card set. So increase heroes dealt by 20%, attacking debuff enemies, that's not ideal. Decrease all crit resistance and crit defense by 25%. That is not ideal either, but that's okay. Um, all right. So, like I said, this team is serving me pretty well. I'm hoping that once I add Thonar Relic to it, I'm going to increase her attack so she no longer patience as a tool, and then she also um, obviously keeps everyone alive because the HP related stats is, is a bit of a bit of a goal, bit of a dream. So we're going to do this again. I'm going to do one, two, three, and then I'm actually going to try and push the result relatively quickly. But I want to proc the attack related stats buff, and I want to. Um, give myself, yeah, I want to give myself the attack release. That's okay, cool. And I did get another green card, so that is good. This is a problem when he crits, it hurts. Oh, ouch. Okay. Ow. Okay. So, I'm going to get rid of that. I'm going to do that that and then I'm gonna pop a heal to try and keep my Freya alive. Um, this is all about survival this one. Um, so I'm going to 
Yeah, we've got an attack. Give us some heal. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to be enough heals. As long as he can survive here. Oof. We'll call, we'll call the run when someone dies. Because, oh, I'm not. Okay. So. I'm going to have to do that. Go one. And then... Oh, 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 okay. Um, hmm. I don't know if she's going to... If she's going to patience or not. But if she doesn't, we get wiped anyway, I think. I love her. I love wish it's knowing that it taunts now. I'd love to be able to remove buffs. And then... Okay, okay, okay. So I'm going to have to do that. I'm going to have to heal up and I'm going to have to hope that this can get through the damage. Otherwise, I am definitely in trouble here. Because the defense stats go through the roof. So we'll see. Yeah. That is uh, incredibly annoying. Uh, we've got three stacks of passive and full HP. Maybe we can tank it. Maybe. Come on. Oh my gosh. Okay. Survive. Yeah, okay. Alright, we're going to call it there, guys. This is where it gets difficult for me with no relics or uh, with no Thono relic. Uh, but this is the team I've been using. It's got me further than the than the Dogs team, uh, than the King's Patience team. Um, but I'll definitely be doing a video on that once I get a King's Holy Relic as well. Um, so we're going to leave it there. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is like my second kind of team that I've been running with this. And it's, as you can see, doing okay. Um, if you guys have got any other teams you want me to try, let me know in the comments below. I'm going to go get my Thonar Alec and I will be right back. Um, cheers, guys. I'll catch you in the next one.